adjusting of the uh, facing. Look here, look here. This is uh, cylinder one, five, three, six, two, four. You can see here, cylinder one is one degree, that one is okay, that one is half a degree, number three, and then it's okay. So what I have to do now is adjust number three. It's a half a degree, I have to have a roller here that is one tenth of a millimeter bigger. Let's go see here. 14.9, I need a roller that is 15.0. Ah, but fun! The fourteen ninety-eight. It's okay. Skal du stå still i jävla maskinen? Du du går ut hemvet här för det. Det blir så jävla bra. Hej. EDC OM606. Let me show you how to do this. Hang on. So to get more fuel out of this pump, I need to adjust the rack travel sensor. And this is the way that I do it. Hang on here. If we see here, we see that 1.95 voltage is the low idle. Now the uh, bench is uh, shut off here, but I can show you here that 1.95 eight seven okay anyway that is around 6.7 millimeter of rack travel so what I do is that I decrease the rack travel with around one millimeter like this root there I have one millimeter less rack travel here around it's a bit sticky now uh, when the when the bench is not working anyway like that we say like that one point one millimeter less rack travel and then the sensor says 1.76 
voltage back and that is too low I need 1.950 voltage how to do it yes we take this plug out here and adjust the rack travel backwards if I adjust it backwards as much as I can I gain one millimeter here then 5.7 millimeter is the new 6.7 millimeter and here I can start up the test bench and the pump will not deliver as much fuel as I want to do and I can adjust it on the forks and then I gain one more millimeter isn't it fantastic yay it's fantastic let me hear you say yay <laughs> Men det var då själva fan! Ut med det plugggävel! Så enkelt var det. That's about all I have to say about that.